Hello, I'm back from New Jersey. This is Timmy Tukoski, Tim Tukoski Family Channel. Now, I'm not lost. I'm not the same today. I'm not in as much pain as I was. I guess the trip took a little bit out of me, and I was really disoriented on that ship. Oh, I can't believe I went forward instead of back on that. But anyway, um, enough of that. I'm in my kitchen my little messy kitchen but I'm in my kitchen as you can see uh, I'm making crepes crepe cookery basic crepe cookery got a little sugar here it's more than enough and more than enough flour I gotta get out the rest of my gear I'm just gonna take out the one cup thing I get I, I just base it from there uh, all I do is I put two cups of flour, one cup of sugar, no nutmeg, no nut spice, egg, a couple of eggs, special milk. Keep whipping it until I get it to the, my white consistency because I like them thin. And then when I cook these crepes, they're going to be cooked. I'm going to get this pan going. I'm going to put it on medium heat. I cook these crepes, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to have this uh, almost like paper thin. I mean, it's just amazing. Um... I was going to try to cook with the one hand and hold my camera, but that might not work. Um, and if I put my camera up where I had it before, it didn't work. I could make like a, a stand. I could probably, I might be able to put it on my cereal boxes or something. Or uh, uh, stand it up like here or something. Can I, can I actually see my camera right here? If I, if I can balance my camera. Actually... That might work. But I have to keep turning to my camera and, and, and be careful not to bump it. Okay, all right. All right. <clears throat> this will be a better angle. It won't be high like when I did my pogi video. Um, Creep! You gotta love crepes, baby. Creeps! It's like the ultimate thing, man. It's like the ultimate thing. It's like, ooh. Now, I'm getting that pan warm. And the thing about this pan, these are the sweet ones, okay? If, I, if, I, if I'm going to make a, a, like a dinner crepe, like a ham crepe, I might do that in a video, too. Uh, make my ham and asparagus crepes. I got my asparagus in the freezer. Might do that in one of my videos. Um, these are gonna be my sweet ones. That's what my family loves the most. Um, some people want French pancakes. Because uh, they all like a pancake, but they're really thin pancakes. I do this as I go, I clean as I go. I'm not gonna get me in really, okay. Not my egg. They're all spice. I'm gonna do my two eggs. I'm gonna crack my two eggs. I'm kind of standing on an angle so you can see me. have a small towel when I'm doing this stuff. Um, yeah, good luck trying to find things. I guess I should have known. I guess I should have dug for it first. Anyway, um, okay. Now watch. Some people do crepes in a blender. Not me. I'm old school. I got my whisk, my milk, I'm gonna wet this. I'm just gonna wet this. Just 
start getting this mixed up a little bit here. I'm going to keep going until I get it to the right consistency. See, it makes a pancake batter, see? This stick right here is like a thick pancake batter. But, if I was going to make a pancake batter, I would want it to rise. So, I would put the baking soda and baking powder in it. Not just, not just this. But these I don't want to rise. These are going to be really, really thin. This pan gets really hot. Because you do this with the pan. Just a little bit more milk. Like I said, I, don't, I want these to my... You do these for a long time, you just get the right consistency. <clears throat> you just play it. My family say I'm a master cake cook even when I'm sick and even when I'm not 100%. And I haven't been 100% lately. I've been, I have been in pain lately. And that gets frustrating. See? Make a batter consistency. You don't want them too thin, you don't want them too thick. Now these will make a lot. Because watch, watch what I do here. When I put them in the pan, watch what I do. Now I'm going to put a little butter on the pan, even though this is a, it's that new green nonstick pan that I don't have to put butter on this pan. I'm going to put some butter in the pan. Now that's it, look. You can see that in that camera. That's perfect. Now, I got the stove. I think you can kind of see the stove here. I'm going to turn the camera a little bit more. Wow. Maybe I shouldn't have touched it. Yeah, it looks like you can see the stove on my camera. All right, now, <clears throat> putting this right here, <laughs> that, that back close the camera pretty nicely. Um, butter ahead of that one. I roll my butter down, and I go like this. I just go around here a little bit like that with the butter. Okay? So people flip the crepes, I don't, <clears throat> I don't. <clears throat> now I take my spatula. Put it about half full and watch this. Actually, it might be a little bit more. Now I'm going to go around. They're not thin enough yet. See, they're not going around the pan. See, this one's not going all the way around the pan. So I'm probably going to use a full scoop. I'm going to make it just a little bit thinner. You want it big enough to go around the bottom of the pan. And they're going to spread out like this. So maybe a little bit thinner. Yeah, a little bit thinner. I make these things like paper thin. Oh, there you go. That's even better. Now watch. See? Oh, it doesn't take very long to cook. This ain't around the pan, but the next one should be. The first one doesn't usually have it completely perfect. 
but it's done. Now, some people put powdered sugar in them. I'm gonna make them jam. Well, actually, I'm gonna make a. I'm gonna use this plate. I'm just tasting my first one. I'm gonna use this plate to um. the pan to the white heat. We'll put powdered sugar. And then warm them up. And you roll it up. And I'm going to taste it. It's pretty simple. It's not hard. Let me do one more and show you around how I do it all the way around the pan. It was just a little tiny bit thick. Now, you clean this plate with a tiny bit of soap. You might have another plate, you know. I use my water really hot. I'm going to make a stack of them. I might even turn off the camera here in a minute. Um, I might sing a song here. I might just keep the camera on for a little while and, and, and sing a song here. I don't usually use a towel to dry the plate. I try to get the stuff air dry. Now, <clears throat> now I'm going to make one. And you saw how fast that turned out. It just didn't go all the way around the pan. But you see how good I am at this. Now, I don't need to butter a pan. I don't need to butter a pan like this one. But I do. Because it, it, you got to have that butter flavor with the crepe. Now watch. this pan all the way around it oh yeah baby oh yeah I'm just gonna let it drip I'm gonna let it go around yeah forms to the pan see bottom part of the pan it's coated with the crate I'm going to put it on the heat for just a minute until the top part cooks. <clears throat> See, singing a song. I mean, about Christmas I sing, Oh, holy night. But I'm not doing that one. Um, wow. I did do it after cut up Danny Boy. Uh, Well, <clears throat> Illinois River Song, because I'm right here by the Mississippi River. Can you see me on the camera? Hey! Old Man River, that old man river, he must know something. Look at that. Nice crate. They don't say nothing, he keeps on rolling. He keeps on rolling. Watch this. Wow. Ooh, yes. Along. Kind of stuck. Old Man River. Doesn't take much. They're really thin. They're like paper. They are like paper.
Okay. Hey, it keeps on rolling. I'm going to get this one perfect. The first of crepes are that way. It, it's a perfect one. It just um, didn't come off the pan like I wanted it. Took that barge, lift that bear, a little drunk in your land in jail. Let's just watch. Can I do it? This one perfect? Yes, of course. Coat the pan. Old man river. taste in the batter. The first couple ones I always eat anyway. I haven't eaten anything so I was zapping my first couple. That's the way that is. I keep the other spoon in here. Old Man River, that Old Man River, you must know something. We don't say nothing. I'm going to get a small crate. Put this crate on. Now if this worked out perfect, watch. Gotta be quick, gotta be quick, gotta be quick. That's it! That's it! There's my paper thin crepe, now watch. You can practically see my hand through there. You can see my finger through there, man. Look at that, it's like paper. I don't know if you can see it. It's like paper. You see your hand through there, man. That's how I do quick, baby. Now you can put jam in it. Orange marmalade. I love it with orange marmalade. Uh, black jam. That's my question of the day. How do you like your crepe? What do you want? What do you like inside of your, your French pancake or your sweet crepe? And like I said, I'm gonna do another video one day with me making a dinner crepe. I'm gonna make a ham and, and asparagus dinner crepe, but that'll die for. Uh, but my question is, what do you like inside of your sweet crepe? You like orange marmalade, uh, uh, black jam, uh, raspberry jam, uh, hit me up, like, comment, subscribe. This is Timothy Koski from the Timothy Koski and Family Channel. Blessings always, my friends. This is Crepe Cookery 101. Yeah. Yeah, the pan's clean too, look. I mean, that's just so awesome. This, matter of fact, I'm gonna, I'm gonna kind of hold this up so you can actually see a step. Put the butter on there. I'll take this batter. I'll go right here in the middle. But then you have to be quick. I let it drip, but then you have to be quick. You're gonna grab the batter. See, whip it around, wash it, wipe it around, wash it around. Did it, did it, did it drip, did it drip, did it drip. It's gonna drip all over the pan. It's gonna drip over the pan and pour into that pan. It's gonna drip and pour into that pan. It's gonna be a piece of paper thin crepe. It's paper thin, see? I, I don't, I, a lot of people are like, oh, crepes are hard, but you know what? I actually enjoy doing crepes, you can tell. I mean, I just have a blast doing these, man. See? Watch it cook. So that was my shout out question. Um, I was going on the old man boat river. Okay. The second part of old man river. Tote that barge, zip that bail, get a little drunk in your land in jail. See that perfect creep right there? Ooh, look at that. It's, it's thin. You can see it through the plate. It's paper, man. It's like paper.
Old Man River, that old man river, he must know something, but he don't say nothing, he keeps on rolling, he keeps on rolling. Look at that, it comes, look at that, it is so nice, look at that. it just moves around that pan, I love these pans like this, the cake will never stick, and yes, it's, it's completely cooked, it doesn't take long at all. He keeps on rolling. He keeps on rolling. I'm gonna be quick. I'm gonna be quick. That's it. Look, stacks right up. That's my crepe cookery. Now you know how I make crepes. And of course, you just put your butter, jam, syrup, whatever you want to put inside of there. You roll it up like I rolled that one up. I rolled that one up. That one with powdered sugar. Here it is, it's the rolled up one with the potted sugar. See, it rolls up. And that's it. This is Timothy Koski from Timothy Koski Family Channel. I'm going to make a, a big stack of crepes and put them in my oven and wait for my family to come home and eat. Uh, that's my crepe cookery. Blessings always. Blessings always. Ooh. Uh, oh, and I got the, we already changed change, change this shirt on one of my favorite channels, man. I sent them a card actually for Christmas. Yeah. Okay. Bye now.